This is Nathan Barley with another video on the Lego salvage machine. I've been making some pretty good progress lately. Uh, most of the work has centered on the um, aft part of the machine. Uh, I've started putting together some aesthetic touches. I have these uh, nice oh, panels here which should cover up um, some of the machinery inside. One on this side, one over here, then one on top here. Uh, I've also put on the uh, rear fenders here. Uh, I've also disconnected the rear outriggers from the forward outriggers. The um, process of extending them and putting them down was quite slow. So I disconnected them. They now have their own motor uh, right here. I also installed the braking system on the machine. The braking system consists of the uh, motor here, a single cylinder pneumatic pump here, then a switch and a valve. The valve is really a dump valve and is used, is closed so the system can build up pressure and apply the brakes and then release to just dump all the pressure and release the brakes. And the switch um, goes to turn on the brake lights, it's just a nice aesthetic touch. And also feeds information to the transmission controller to tell it when to um, disengage the clutch. Now the braking system itself on the axles, um, the brakes are only present on the number two axle. They consist of the a uh, small pneumatic cylinder here, then a small rubber band here. The rubber band um, is designed to pull the two brake shoes away from the wheel. Then when the brakes are applied, the pressure builds up, the cylinder expands, and the shoes are pressed against the inner rim of the rear wheel hub. So, yeah, right around in this area. And the brakes are applied that way. So, now let me zoom out a bit and... Uh, give you a little demonstration. So there, turn the pump on. Pressure's building up. And you can see that the shoes have expanded out. And let me just turn it off and release the brakes running the motor in the opposite direction. So there the dump valve has opened and all the pressure is released. So that's applied. You can see the cylinder slowly expanding the shoes out. Fully applied. Motor off and released. Releasing the brakes. There. Now I've tested this just in pushing the uh, wheels along the floor. It seems to work actually very well. So should have very little trouble stopping the machine. Um, I've also worked on installing the um, trailer hitch on the rear part of the machine. The trailer hitch is really just a small um, pin right there that the little Lego piece is designed to slide into. And then you have the uh, cover here. The cover is uh, spring-loaded. It's just designed to hold the uh, little collar in place and prevent it from hopping up off the pin. So that's really what I've done. Uh, keep watching for more details.